guys welcome back to my youtube channel and of course thank you so much guys for watching my very first video thank you so much for giving it a thumbs up and thank you for subscribing i really really appreciate it so today i went into social media and a few people were writing you know some of the lessons that they learned in 2019 in 2018 all right so that you know gave me a thought as well and it made me ask myself if you are what did you learn in 2018? So I'm going to be giving you four lessons that I learned in 2019, in 2018. Not that I didn't learn so much. I did learn so much. But these are the four lessons that stood out for me in 2018 that I learned. Let's get into it. Goodbye 2018. Say what? Hello 2019. All right. So the very first lesson that I learned in 2018 is that be bold, all right? Be bold to do your life the way you want to do it, all right? Because uh, so many times we are always so um, scared to go for that which you want to go for, to step away or to go forward or to walk away just because we are always so scared of what people are going to say or probably so scared of, you know, failing. But the question is, we cannot live life, you know, on the edge. We need to literally just allow ourselves to go out there and do that which we want to do. If it means walking away from certain people that you have to walk away from, be bold enough to do that. It's okay. And we need to know that it's not always the case that our decisions have to be popular. I mean, why should we make popular decisions? We need to allow ourselves to make decisions that aren't necessarily popular as long as they make us happy so be bold enough to make those decisions even if people are not um you know giving them thumbs up because after all they are making you happy you are happy with those decisions and it matters to you the most so why not do that for yourself so be bold all right and of course the second thing that i learned of course is that um you need to allow yourself to start just start hunt hey or you know because um starting helps us to be able to gain momentum in the process that we have to um, get into probably you want to you know for example let me just give you an example with me I've always re been recording so many videos um, you know uh, that I thought I wanted to post here on YouTube but the thing is I've not um, been able to start or open up the YouTube channel just because I've been so scared what are they gonna say how are they gonna feel about that which I'm gonna do or say uh, uh, oh no uh, guys it's okay, just start. You have nothing to lose because at the end of the day, there's always going to be people who are going to say negative things. There's going to be people who are going to be positive about that which you are going to do or have, been, have, have done. And imagine if you don't allow yourself to start just because you're scared of this, this bit that is not happy, you know. So allow yourself to start because at the end of the day, it's all for you. This life thing is all for you. If you want to start a family, start a family. Okay, you need to be able, you need to, to think first about, you know, that which you want to start doing. But all, all, all that I'm saying is if you want to start um, that which you want to start, start without really, you know, putting yourself under so much pressure of what people are going to say because at the end of the day, people are still going to have something to say, either good or bad. So just start, all right? So the third um, thing that I want to tell you that I learned about in 2019 is that we need to be prepared. Be prepared. So many times we always kneel down and say, God, I need this and this and this. Please give me one, two, three things. God, please give me, please give me. But the thing is, are we prepared to receive those things and to do what is supposed to be done with those things? Are you prepared to receive that child? Are you prepared to receive that job? Are you prepared for that promotion? So prepare yourself. If it means you reading uh, as a way to prepare yourself, read. If it means you asking questions, ask questions. If it means you um, exercising, exercise. Prepare yourself for whatever. Prepare your Solve. Don't wait for the last minute just um, and then you wake up and life seems like it, it hasn't been happening and you're just only receiving that um, by surprise. Prepare yourself because those that, those things that you prepare yourself for, you will definitely receive. That's what I believe and that's what I feel um, um, really, really works for me. If I allow myself to prepare, I will definitely receive those things because I will be preparing for those things that I want to receive and 
I am doing, uh, taking the right steps into receiving them, taking the right step, steps into going to them and going to grab them for myself. So allow yourself to prepare for that which you want to receive in your life and for that which you want God or um, the universe to bring into your life. Always prepare, all right? And of course, the last lesson that I learned in 2018 is the importance of support. We all know about support. It's very important for us to support one another. But guys, 2018 has made me realize that support is that thing that is very, very important. That is why, this is why I'm saying that. It's because I got married here in, like, in 2018, here in 2018. I got married in 2018, all right? So what I learned in 2018 is that um, it's, sometimes so difficult for people to say i need you to support with me with one two three but when you realize that they need your support and you have a bit of an idea of how you can support them go go for it you will never know how much of a difference that you are making by supporting them it doesn't necessarily have to be with money it can be with your time it can be with your idea with what let's support one another because supporting one another helps to make um live you know bring take somebody from um a bad space into a better space so let's support one another all right now i want to give you guys a bonus lesson that i learned in 20 18 it's something that you guys know about i think all these you know about them but let me just tell you that what i learned about in 2018 which is a bonus one i learned about love in 2018 i've already i had already you know known about love but this year i learned that i need to love more i need to love you know go in with this love thing you know love makes a, the world a better place you know, it's very important that we love our partners, we love our friends, we love our families, you know. Sometimes we become so, so busy and so consumed with our lives that we forget the people in our lives, all right. Yes, love yourself. Excuse me, that is very, very important. At the same time, allow yourself to love people in your lives because they need... Sometimes people become so lost. And when we give one another love, we sometimes bring people back to the life that they're supposed to be back in back to a better place so let's love one another guys thank you so much guys for watching my video i appreciate it what are some of the lessons that you learned in 2018 that you would all mind sharing with me please leave them on the comment section it'll be so um interesting to read about the lessons that you learned in 2018 and of course please subscribe to my channel i would really really appreciate that and um what's the other thing please give my video a thumbs up if you really really loved it guys happy 2019